Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I here with Beautiful Beauty. Going to be doing a skincare product review for you beauties here today. Okay guys, everybody knows that I love skincare. I, when I first start talking about skincare, I cannot help but to get almost just giggled up, you know, and just burst out in laughter because, you know, here I am again, another skincare product, but I love skincare. We are all skincare junkies here. We are total skincare gurus, you know? Okay, I've loved skincare forever. You guys know this. I mean, <laughs> my passion, I seriously think my passion and obsession with skincare is truly just that. It is my passion in life, if you know what I mean. Okay, here is a brand. I love this brand. I talk a lot about this brand on my channel. I buy this brand a lot. I do tons of product reviews on this brand. I... Um, love this brand okay so this is Avalon Organics I think I was gonna say something else but yeah sometimes just your words and your thoughts and your mind just do not connect or measure up all at once when you sit down to get filming you know what I mean okay I love Avalon Organics I love this brand I truly do they're cruelty free they're not tests on animals I've been using Avalon Organics I think it seems forever at least six or seven years and as you guys know in skincare years six or seven years that's a long time <laughs> that's a long time so I really like the brand um, I think their prices are great too they're not overly inflated on their prices um, you know they have good pricing okay this is the wrinkle therapy with CoQ10 and rosehip. Okay, I love anything with rosehip. I love rosehip oil. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, this is the day cream formula. It says smooths fine lines and wrinkles and restores elasticity. It says scientifically proven to smooth skin texture, non-GMO. It is vegan and biodegradable. And it comes in a, the size is a one 0.75 fluid ounce and it is a pump style one of these airless pumps and I actually do like the dispenser I know a lot of airless pumps I have all kinds of crazy trouble you can literally just pump all day and the product doesn't come out I have not had any trouble with this design on this airless pump so big thumbs up for that yeah I really like this product I really really do been using this for about a month a month and a half now and I really do like it. It works really totally well as a day cream. It works absolutely well underneath makeup, underneath cosmetics. Now, when I say makeup, I wear a everyday makeup. I wear very light makeup for every day. Now, I love heavy makeup and heavy made up looks. However, you know, it's just, I don't get around to doing that, you know, that often unless I have, you know, a ball to go to, a, you know, a high function event, some big, important meeting or whatever so anyhow on day-to-day -day makeup what I like to wear so this works underneath my makeup well for me but let me tell you the makeup I wear I really only keep it scaled down to pressed powder loose powder or um, just mineral powder in general is what I mean so yeah I just wear powder I don't really wear foundation I don't wear BB cream I, I rarely wear those now um, I never can get a good match for my skin and my color and all that good stuff. So I stick with the basic average everyday look for me is powder. So I wear this under my powder and I don't use a primer, have not been um, anyhow lately. So I use this in place of a primer. It works very well for me. That gives me a light, nice, even light coverage for me. Wearing this, using it basically as a day cream slash primer and then put my pressed powder or my mineral powder, or loose powder or whatever it is I wear you know for the day on it's just depending on day to day whatever I feel like you know I really like this stuff I think it works great I have very dry sensitive skin it is not irritating to my skin at the least I get no redness I get no tightness no irritation it does not bother my skin in any way so I really like that so it works well for my sensitive skin love that let me see if I could tell you some more specifics here about it always like to try to you know look at the box and give the box a little scrutiny here it says apply to face and neck after cleansing and toning um, da, da, da. basic directions okay non-gmo paraben free 
no harsh preservatives, no synthetic colors or fragrances, no phthalates, no sodium lauryl sulfate or laureth sulfate, no animal testing. So I love that. Definitely sounds great there. Um, let's see, see what else I can show you here. There's the ingredients if you're interested. I know I'm always super interested in ingredients. I know not every product that I use definitely has great ingredients, but I prefer great ingredients. I prefer more natural. I do prefer more organic if I can get that. Um, less carcinogens, less cancerous causing ingredients, chemicals, agents, all that stuff. So there are the ingredients if you're interested. Okay, hopefully, hopefully it focused and you can see that. I really do like this stuff. It really works well for me as a day cream. It is very hydrating for my skin. I have very dry, sensitive skin. It offers the right level of daily moisturization for me. It's not overly greasy. It's not overly heavy. It's not um, heavy weighted cream. It is more of a lightweight in the consistency and the volume and the texture of it is more lightweight. Not sure if this will really even demonstrate, but let's see. I want you to see how it just really, it absorbs very quickly. It does not seem to sit on top of the skin for too long and it's not sticky. I really like that and the smell. Okay, it has like a, um, I wanna say, almost a grape seed smell to it, okay? It really doesn't smell, I know it has rose hip in it, but it really doesn't smell like rose hip smell, like rose hip oil to me. Yeah, smelling my hand right now um, has a very low key fragrance. The smell is very good for me because I have awful, icky bad sinus problems. You guys know this. I talk about this so often. Have really bad sinus problems, have a real scent sensitivity issue, very sensitive to smells. It's a very low key smell, a barely there smell, a almost not there smell. And um, after upon application, you put it onto your face. Within 10 minutes, that slight smell is you know completely gone. And I don't even smell the product anymore once it saturates into my skin. So it's not sticky. I like it. It's not overly greasy. It's not overly heavy of a, a cream, uh, but yet it gives you the right level of moisturization to be that of a cream. You know what I mean? It's more similar to a lotion, but it does hydrate like a cream because, you know, it is a day cream, hence the word <laughs> cream, you know. Um, so it's not watered down like a lotion or anything like that. It gives the right amount of moisturization. It is really humectant for my skin and it's moisturizing, so I really like it. Now, um, in all honesty, I'm gonna tell you, you know, just straight up, I cannot tell you how well it works on wrinkles or uh, fine lines or crow's feet or, yeah, or anything like that. I really can't because I don't have any wrinkles. Um, so far, I don't. I've been lucky that way. <laughs> yeah, and I really, really take good care of my skin. So um, it, it's a really a blessing from not only genetics, but it is a blessing from education and persistence pays off. Okay, so I don't have any wrinkles to try this out on. So I honestly can't tell you if it smooths out fine lines or wrinkles or anything like that. I would like to hope it does. Let me know, you guys, if you have... a uh, few wrinkles, one or two wrinkles, a fine line or a crow's feet starting or anything like that. Let me know if this product works for you for that issue. I can just tell you it works great underneath my makeup. It is very moisturizing. It smooths my skin out very well and I really do like it and I get no irritation from it. Love it. And I just really love the brand uh, Avalon Organics. It rarely disappoints. I really do love this brand. I bought this one at, I believe this last time I bought the order, da, da, da. okay, I think I bought it from Vitacost.com. I either bought it from Swanson's Vitamins or Vitacost.com. <laughs> okay, either way, I will check my receipts because I do a ton of online shopping. As you guys know, love it. So I'm gonna check my receipts and I will put where I bought it from exactly and the price I paid for it in the down bar below. I remember it being a good price, but I really think it's a great product. Go ahead, check it out, give it a try. Let me know if you like it. Let me know if you already use this product. Love you guys so very much. Be sure to share my videos, like my videos, recommend my videos, leave me comments, leave me love and hugs because I love you guys back. Take care now, bye.